it's it's an opportunity I really enjoy, but also they give back so much because they have stories to tell, like we all do. And those are very interesting stories and we can't know what the story is gonna be about. Uh, when we meet them, we have no idea what where they're coming from, what's really happening. And uh, the magic of it is that they, a lot of the time, give more than you're expecting uh, or give in a different way than what you're expecting. And they always surprise you in terms of what they have to say, what their story is. You can never assume who they are, where they come from, um, what matters to them. There's always a surprise in store in terms of who's going to um, be the person who really excels at this. You know, sometimes certain kids, they might seem more introverted and, and have nothing to say or really anxious about, you know, being at the top, the front of the class and having to present something. But then somewhere along the way, something happens and they find their voice. And to me, that makes it all worth it because, you know, I think in a lot of ways, I'm one of those people who, uh, from the outset, people would say, you know, I don't expect him to have uh, a lot to say as an artist, you know, as a musician or as a poet, um, if you see me in my everyday life, but then given the opportunity to be on stage, I've learned how to take advantage of it and surprise people with what I have to say. And we can all do that. Uh, I'm still in the beginning stages of trying to connect with these kids, uh, even though they have masks on. And that, that feels a little um, unusual disembodying um so I'm, I'm struggling with that but at the same time i can see that they're excited that i'm there um that someone is in the classroom someone is engaging them in a different way and getting them to express themselves um so that's still exciting 